And so then that brings me to another uh, point that I like to make with hospitals, and really it's more of an opinion piece, to ask you, if you have to be bitten by a nymph or by an adult, what's your preference? Which would you rather be bitten by? Mm -hmm. yeah. You'd rather be bitten by a nymph? Okay. Sure, it's fed on fewer things. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's a really good point. So fed on fewer things means it only fed once, right? And so if it fed on a white-footed mouse, it has about a quarter, about 25% chance of being infected with Borrelia. So the <laughs> infection rate is actually somewhat low. And so you, you know, that's a very viable argument is that if it only fed once, you have a one in four chance that it was infected with Lyme disease. And if you pull it off quickly, then, you know, uh, you, you're playing your percentages, whereas with the adult ticks, they're actually 50% infected with Borrelia, so you know it can go either way because they've had a chance to feed twice and pick up Borrelia a second time, so they have a higher infection rate, and so therefore you're saying, well, I don't really you know, want to take that 50-50 risk, I'd rather take a one in four risk. So that's a viable argument. I have people go the other way. Would anybody uh, argue that they'd rather be bitten by an adult? Well, then you can see it. <laughs> exactly. That's what I would say, Dr. Brenda. My personal experience, I've had uh, nymphs and adults attached to me numerous times. I would rather have the adult because I've never been bitten by an adult deer tick when I didn't know it because they have really long mouth parts and they really hurt when they bite you. And so, you know, for me, I feel confident that, okay, if a, you know, an adult bites me, I'm going to know it and I'm going to be able to remove it. Whereas with the nymph, when I've had those, it's a question of, oh gosh, I didn't realize I had a freckle there, and you know, then you happen to find it, but you think, well, if it was somewhere where I couldn't see, then you know, I wouldn't know that it was there, and I'd be much more scared of the nymph. So there's a good argument either way, and again, it just comes down to whether or not you uh, understand the life cycle, you can answer the question and uh, have your own personal opinion.